It's 2021, and I just hope everybody gets theirs in 2021. I'll get mine, you get yours, and we all get ours. But trust me, today's show is not your regular. And when I say it's not your regular, even you, when I introduce my guest, you will stand up wherever you are, and you'll give a standing ovation to this beautiful, mm -hmm. uh, amazing, uh, mm -hmm. sensational, mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Okay. Should I continue? Yes, but wait, let me just introduce our guest. Our guest is a Nigerian British rapper, songwriter, and producer known for her English Yoruba lyrics. Born Adishola Adesimbo Idu. She is also known as the rapper Tena. Her main influences are Fela Kuti, Missy Elliott, Jimi Hendrix, Lauren Hill, Tina Turner, Dr. Dre, The Neptunes, and Ladbaja. In 1992, she released the single, I Want to Make You Jack. Like, mm. let's get wet. Ah, mm. wait, let's get wet. Is there any deal which received positive reviews from music critics? She rose to fame with the album, Simply Weird, which had the hit single, Allen Avenue, Allen Avenue, Allen what? Allen Avenue. New Alan, ah, I'm done this thing too much. In 2006, she released a sophomore album after the storm, which featured another hit single title, Ijoya, eh, eh, Ijoya, eh, eh, Ijoya, Awala Nijo. Produced by Don Jazzy and JJC. That's to show you that the greatness, no be to do. Mm -hmm. The album earned her the best pop album at the 2007 Headies, mm -hmm. an Amen Award for Most Pop Song and a Channel Home Music Video Award for Best Special Effects, and, mm -hmm. and several other, say I say several, several new. <laughs> she took a break from her career to study music technology at the Institute of Music and Technology, Depth, um, Depth Ford, in England. In 2010, she was the last woman remaining in the celebrity version of the reality show mm. Gouda Ultimate okay. Search. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, with that no further ado, let's Welcome. rise up for the phenomenal Wee! Hey. Ah! <laughs> oh, what me? <laughs> MC. <laughs> welcome to the show. Welcome, Red welcome, MC. welcome. Thank you welcome. so much. Good welcome. morning, people. Yeah. Brr, I'm in the building. Yes, yes. you are. Oh, 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 it's going, going well. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, I'm in my mother tongue. Boon Siri. Boon Siri. Boon Siri. Boon Siri. Okay, you've learned something. Yeah, Boon Siri. Welcome to the show. Yes, welcome. How have you been? I've been cool. I've been cool. I've been hibernating. God has been keeping me. And you're I not think, aging, I just, I just, your skincare. Yeah, that's what people are saying. I'm not aging. Why are you using milk to shower and like honey to sleep in? Like, what's you, going my on? My question is, are you a vampire? Very mm. simple. No, very simple. It's just very, very simple. Lots of water, minding my business. <laughs> <laughs> lots of exercise. Honestly, mind. lots of exercise. Mm. And the word, the word of God. Mm. The word of God. All right, so oh speaking God. of the word of God, I would like to ask you, what has changed since the weird MC of Ijoya, you know? I want to get wet, let's get jacked, you know that weird <laughs> MC? <laughs> <laughs> and this new weird MC, what has changed about you? Because I noticed a change, you know? Mm. Even when you came in, there was this flow oh you know, God, that man. I felt in my body <laughs> as soon as you walked in. It wasn't just you that you didn't walk alone. No. Wow, yeah. Amen. So, yeah. So, so yes, tell us what has right. changed. Mm. Um, it's honestly, I'll just give you one word. It's, it's Christ in me, the hope mm. of glory. It's Christ in me. Um, you get to a point where you start to like really realize, you start to come to terms, you start to really understand what you carry. Mm. So it's God in me, you mm. know. And um, and that doesn't take away from the music at all. You mm. know? But when the new songs come to the fore, that will that would just flow through the music mm. okay. because we were we were we were made for His pleasure. You. Everybody in here were created for his pleasure, you know, and he's given us that rare ability to just um, reveal him to, to the world in different ways through music, through art, even through what you're doing, mm. through what you guys are doing right now, through film, in every way whatsoever. Mm. You know, that's what it is. It's that, honestly, it's that simple. But you, you're still, I mean, I can still sense that you're, you're still the weird MC. Like, yes. There's still that young, hippie. Um, vibe to you and I'm kind of glad that you know watching that you've had that for years so it's really who you are because you haven't been able to shake that off or whatever but I want to know what that's been like for you um, just living in Nigeria as weird MC and everything that entails you're not the regular even for my parents you're not the regular mm. um, uh, stereotypical societal made female your attitude your character your interest so how has that been from a personal point of view um it was bitter and it was sweet at the same time. 
but it was a good thing as well because I, I feel that it's really, really helped me to become really, really strong. You, I will come across people who will just say, we don't even like you. They'll be really, really blunt like that. Mm, we wow. don't like you, you know. Mm. But I, and then I've had like instances where when I get on stage and I come off stage and the person's like, oh, mm. oh, I love you now. <laughs> but the thing is, I made up my mind right from the get-go, I will be nothing but myself. Mm. Right. Because the thing is, look, Nigerians are very, very real people. And at the end of the day, it, it, we, we can spot a phony, mm. you know, miles away. Mm. So... Sure. Just why don't you just keep it real? Be yourself, you know. Mm. And there's something that I always said right from the get go. It's even in my bio. I said you cannot put me in a box. Mm. Mm. You can't put labels on me. Mm. I remember the the um, the um, I think it was a hip hop music awards. No, the Fame Music Awards. They found it so so difficult. They said we don't know where to place you. I mm. said that's the point. Mm. There's nowhere to place me. Mm. But to make it easy for you, maybe just call my music fusion or mm. pop or whatever. Mm. So they said, oh, sure. we just call you a pop artist. And I'm like, I'm not a pop artist. I'm just fusion. I always said to people that my music is like a coat of many colors. Mm. You know. I just express the way it comes, it right. comes, you know. Um, I always tell every artist, never ever let anyone put you in a box, mm. you know, because it, it's limitation right there. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's how I want you to sound, that's how I want you to sound. I remember, um, you know, working on the, the album after Ejoya, mm. they wanted me to sound a particular way. They wanted me to sound like another, it, it was like it was a movie. They wanted Ejoya <laughs> part two, and I'm yeah. like, it's all, all a right. movie. You've done Ejoya, it's right. gone. You know, Ejoya, right. yeah. Allen Avenue, mm. Ejoya. Yeah. Mm. So basically, you're probably going to hate me after the show. I don't mind. Oh my God. I don't mind. Do you know why I don't mind? Because I'm just going to put the word out there. And um, what what's my job but to give, to educate these people, right, and inform mm. them. Yeah, so she, when I did a flyer, she told me, if Ellis puts at Ishola, <laughs> weird MC. And I said, ah, everybody knows you as weird <laughs> MC. No? And she said, yeah, because I'm trying to um, bring in my real name and fade away the weird MC. Is there a reason why you really want to fade away the weird MC? And then this year, you have been, you've been talking about your, you know, subtly talking about your new body of work that is coming up and um, that we're going to see the grace of the Lord and all that. Uh, is it Ade Shola that is going to be a in that? You know, is it, or are you, is, she wish to be expecting some weird <laughs> MC mm. that is going to be MC in us, you know, just Bible. Uh, you you can hate me. No, these are fine. just words. <laughs> <laughs> These are just words. You know, the, the Bible says that we're, we're a chosen generation. Mm. We're, pecu we're peculiar mm. ones. What's the meaning of the word weird? Peculiar, different, unique, mm. you know? And I think um, for, for like a second there, mm. I truly, truly believe that the Lord actually used you to minister to me yesterday when you said that. Because someone else said something early, mm. earlier during the day. Thank you. And then you said, why do you want to put Deshola? And then I just backed away and I said, mm. ah, you said something to me. My peer was like, what's wrong with you? Mm -hmm. Word MC will always be Word MC. Mm. So this is my decision right now. This is my only decision right now that as the Lord leads me, if he says to me, I want you to change the name, fine. If he says I don't, if he doesn't say anything about the name, I'll just let the name be. Mm. I think there's something about that name that I myself, I don't truly, I haven't truly grasped it mm. yet. I think there's mm. more to it than it just okay. being a stage hey, name. I think fam. there's more mm. to it. So I've just let it be. So we'll keep, so thank you for doing that. Aww. Thank you for... Opening up your heart and allowing the Lord you to you minister thank you. to you. There's a way to frame words. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go and frame your words right now. But, you know, this, get this that. is obviously yeah. very new. Um, I mean, culturally, we're, we're all something in Nigeria, Christian, Muslim, whatever. But it seems that you are a lot more hands-on and conscious about it. Like, you've kind of, like, personalized that. And I, I know that that is a journey. That doesn't just happen oh, because absolutely. you were born into it or whatever. Absolutely. Um, and it's even for the fact that you're even question changing your name, obviously there is a huge transformation that has gone on with you. Can we talk Within. about? Can we talk about that? Like when did that happen? In what phase? And what led you there? What were you before that? Yeah. I was in a very, very, very dark place before mm. that. When um, you're talking about dark place, can you elaborate on it? A dark place. I was really depressed. Mm. I was just detached, disinterested. I didn't just care about anything anymore. Somebody who was very, very, very close to me in the industry had passed. No more loss. Mm. We're like five and six, mm. and he passed. And I found it very, very difficult to process. Mm. You know, seeing him there, lifeless in the coffin, that was really, really difficult for me to do. Mm. OJB passed, and I was, and I just started to question. 
okay, why am I here? Mm. What, what is life really, really, really about? I think that took me from one step to another. Mm. Now, years before, I, I, I met somebody called Aisha. Mm. And Aisha would just throw things at me like, you know, um, do you know who Jesus is? And I'm like, and I'll just be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'll just like brush it off. Mm. But I would always make a statement that I don't want to be somebody who becomes born again and quote unquote, whatever it's called, backslide. Mm. And then she would just smile. And then I think years again later, it came up again in our conversation. And I'm like, who was this self? And I just let myself go. Mm. That was it. And that was how the journey started. And it's mm. still, I'm still honest. In fact, I'm still a huge, huge work in progress. Mm. All right. But I will tell you this for free. It's inner peace. Mm. I will tell you that for free. It really helped me to see who I am, why I'm here, mm. who and what I was created to become, mm. where I'd gone wrong. Mm. But we serve somebody who is very, very, very merciful. I always tell people Christianity is not a religion. It's who we are. Mm. It's who we are. Yeah, it's, 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 it's about having that personal intimacy, that personal relationship with, mm. with now, God. Now, I'd just like to ask you, since you're saying it's having that personal intimacy, mm. now you have fans, you have people that yes. listen to your music that yes. still expect a yes. certain standard from you. Yes. Now, the new songs that we should be expecting from yes. Weird MC, yes. are they still going to have elements of your old self in it without it? Yeah. losing your relationship with God? Are you going to use your music now to say, oh, I belong to Jesus, I must yeah. serve the Lord, like, I live Lyrics must be for Jesus. Is that what we should be expecting? He is going to lead me. Hmm. He will tell me what to do, how to go about it. Because the thing with me was that I, I got to a point where I had this struggle, like, oh, I want to do this, I want yeah. to do that. And then I have a very, very good friend of mine. She's actually in the studio right now okay. as we're talking. She's filming behind the scenes. And she said to me, you've got to let go. You've got to learn to stop overanalyzing things mm. and just let him be the one. Just let go and let him. We say that thing sometimes, let mm. go and let God, without, without really, really sitting down to really meditate and really know yeah. what we're actually saying. So I'm learning to just let go. You know, we, we like to be in control. We don't like to be, too, we, we don't like right. to be vulnerable, but mm. we have to learn to trust him and not to lean on our own understanding. Right. People will still see. If I hit that stage, you will still know <laughs> I yeah. hit the stage. Yeah. But you, you said something, and that's a testimony for me this morning. You said when I walked in, there was something that you picked up on. I want that to be, I want that to be the reality from mm. now on. When people come into contact with me, they also come into contact with he that is within me. Okay. And that will come through through the music. Mm. Like say, for example, I'm, I'm writing scripts as well. Because the funny thing is that movies were actually actually my first love but music Aww. happened first mm. so everything will just flow mm. okay, but that's just how I, it I want to talk about the music scene I mm -hmm. mean I remember um, Ijoya mm -hmm. and that was in, in comparison to how much things have changed we can say it's a lifetime ago it, I, like the music the industry the yeah. people yeah. Nigerians yeah. our mindsets where yeah. we are yeah the, the climate everything yes. has changed and I'm loving it so, yeah mm. me too Yes. Um, and you know, yeah, it's, yes. it's a, yeah. There's a, been a lot of change, um, and I'm sure you've gone through your process, even away from your 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 spiritual journey, just your artistic sense and absorbing everything that's happened in the in the world today. So I want to know, like, since you're coming back into the music scene a lot more prominent now, is there is there was there a pressure in terms of um, updating? I don't want to say updating, but like. Yeah, evolving. Keeping up, yeah, keeping up, keeping up with the, with your sound. It just it just comes naturally, you know. Mm. The, the, you know, the, the Bible says, "Out of our bellies shall flow rivers of living, living, living water." Mm. So it's ever changing. Mm. So it's not a, it's not a case of trying to catch up. No, it's mm. just you staying in your lane, but still being able to, you're still keeping it open enough for them to be able to relate to you because right. you are talking to them. Yeah. We artists, we're actually ministers. Mm, At yeah. every point in time, we're ministering to people. They're mm, listening sure. to us. Yeah. Do you understand? So this work, so, is it an album? Are, are there features on there? I wouldn't even, I don't even know what to call it. Okay. It's just an expression. Right. But, but having said that, there's someone Spilty that I really, there's someone that I really, really would love to work with. Hmm. 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 I would love to work with Tenny. Oh. I would love to work with um, Kobans. Kobans. Kobans, of course. And nice. Jeremiah Giang, he just remains mm. like vintage, vintage wine, yeah. vintage wine. Mm. So, all right. That's so, a good are, you, are, you, are you are you scared of journalists? 
Am I scared of journalists? Or do you avoid journalists? I don't avoid journalists, but I avoid sensationalists. I'm mm. very, very careful around them. Okay, so this is not sensationalization. It's okay for you to debunk it. You know I said after the show, you may not like me anymore. You may not <laughs> delete my number. Can we not, a troublemaker? Can hmm? we, no, can we just keep things positive? Can yeah, we, no, it's positive. Oh. Can ah, we just... Are you telling me marriage is not a positive thing? Yeah, it was, it it, is, it, right? it's, it's an institution that was created by of God. Of course. So yes. a little bird told me that you're not married in the UK. How ah. true is this? That bird is very, very little. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not true. No, it's not true. It's not true. No. It's an amazing chat with you where them see yeah. it's so much so fun. Much. Yeah. Tell us what's yeah. new. Yeah, you've told us that you're working the on the music. When are we getting movies. in? But when are we getting out? You know, like no, you know, no dates, tomorrow, no, so no dates, us, no dude. dates, but honestly no, soon. So no, yet. I just want you guys to get introduced to a new ensemble in town. A and B, A and B is coming to your school. A and B, they are coming. Yeah. Don't run. They are coming. Ah, they need to shout. Ah, you want to take my job? <laughs> Auntie, you want to take my job? No, no, it's not possible now. Uh, <laughs> Me, all right, share. so um, where them see as. Graced our table. I think this year is it's safe to say by 2020 has been perfect. I'm saying, oh, you said, oh, you, it's, it's safe they to don't say share we, with cup, right? No, but please. we could just do this, oh, right? Mm. I bet we'll make exceptions. It's a weird MC. This is a weird stop going down. <laughs>